uh, I, know, I know a lot of you have, have seen historical TV. Just two days ago on Facebook, uh, someone asked a question about Rowan and Martin's Laugh-In. And they, they said, do you remember the names of the hosts of Rowan and Martin's Laugh-In? <laughs> Seriously? <laughs> I can't even tell you who's buried in Grant's tomb. But uh, I do remember some of the things they did on Laugh-In. Uh, one of the things was uh, uh, the jokes they would tell if, uh, well, let's say if uh, Ella Fitzgerald married Darth Vader, she'd be Ella Vader. <laughs> it's off the air now. <laughs> but if you're a Star Wars freak, to continue on that theme, if Peter Cushing, uh, if Whoopi Goldberg married Peter Cushing, she'd be uh, Whoopi Cushing. But I, I said in, in modern day times, if Latin were to come back, there would be people who would uh, marry and divorce and remarry multiple times. And that opens a whole new array of possibilities. For instance, if Dolly Parton married Tommy Smothers and divorced him and married uh, TV's Mr. Lucky, and divorced him and married comedian Martin Short, and then divorced him and married football kicker Ray Guy, that she'd be Dolly Parton Smothers Lucky Short Guy. <laughs> I want to try something uh, with some psychokinesis a bit later. So, Bruce, did you say you thought you could find from the Shriners a, a light bulb or something? You can find, okay. And also I'm going to try a little bit of art, aside from the magic, a little caricature art. I need a model, someone who would like to volunteer. Would you mind, the young lady over here, would you mind volunteering? Let's give her a big hand. Thank you so much. You're welcome. And you are? This is Jenny. One more time. Thanks, Jenny. Yeah, I'm, I'm Dan. Now, Jenny, what we're going to do is I've got some, uh, uh, I've got some canvas here, some whiteboard, and I have some envelopes that are empty. You can check those out, too, in a minute. And I have some markers. Now, these are permanent markers, which you aren't supposed to use on a whiteboard. But uh, we spare no expense to bring you the finest entertainment in the greater Fulton County area. <laughs> and so for that reason, Jenny, one of these uh, markers will be chosen. Pick one for me. It doesn't matter which one. Uh, purple, OK? And I'll take one also. And I'm going to, with a few bold strokes of the pen, capture the essence of Jenny. Okay, so we'll give this a shot here. Uh, all right, you have a pin for a reason, so hang on to that. The magician, born of seemingly normal parents, tries to capture, oh, a very nice smile. So, big smile, starry eyes. Hair. I don't do straight hair too well. I do a fairly sure simple look. And shoes today. <laughs> there it is. Not the well, not the good. Uh, I'll try to bowl this up a bit. I want to sign the back also. There it is. Now, that's not the best. Uh, it's my first time as a caricature artist. So Jenny, it's your turn to get some revenge. So I'm going to let you draw a picture of me on the other canvas, all right? So here is the canvas, and you get to draw a caricature of me. Go for it. I'll be your easel right now. I'll hold it for you. Dazzling smile. Don't forget the mustache. Nice physique. Normally I don't wear a hat when I perform, so you can do with or without the hat. She wins, hands down. And if you don't mind, would you uh, sign the back of your drawing? Good. Now put the cat back on the pen. Now you come over here and get the uh, envelopes. You can find uh, one of the envelopes. Uh, they're both empty. Yeah, and there's, there's open-ended. So would you slide the envelope over your drawing and hang on to that? Good. I'll take this back and uh, face the front. And I will also do the drawing. 
I want you to do this sort of facing the other side. On the count of three, what I'm going to do is to try an experiment in which your drawing of me and my drawing of you will change places. If I could do that, would that be impressive? Yeah. I wish I could. That would be darn impressive to me too. So when I count to three, I'm going to ask you to, to lift up your drawing on the count of three. So here we go. One, two, three. Hey, that's your, that's your drawing of me, and that's my drawing of you. And I, your, my name is on the back of this one, and your name is on the back of that one. Jenny, you're incredible. Thanks very much for helping me out. Give her a big hand. Thank you. So I'll, did you find a light bulb? Okay, great, great. Well, take it out of the, of the case there, and uh, we'll hand it to someone here. How about uh, uh, the lady here on the front row? This is something I don't normally get to do, but I'm going to try this with everyone in the room. Now, you've got a light bulb there. I want you to hold it up. I want everyone to join hands and to make contact with everybody else in the room at some point. We're going to concentrate on this light bulb. On the count of three, I'm going to ask everyone to concentrate. And when I say count of three, just think the word light. We'll try to use our energy in the room to light the bulb. This is high risk. Probably won't work. We'll give it a shot. Now, if you're in a row by yourself, so put your hand on someone's shoulder so you connect everyone some way or another. Yeah. Are you ready? Yeah. Everybody see the light bulb? Here we go. One, two, three. No, no. Not out loud. You have to say it to yourself. Now, concentrate on the count of three. Here we go. One, two, three. Three. Did anyone actually expect the light bulb to light up? I think we can do it. I'm going to try just one last time. If it doesn't work here, we'll move on with the show. Here we go. One, two, three. Incredible, incredible. Listen, can I? That was, hey, uh, Bruce. That was more than 40 watts, wasn't it? You said 40 watt bulb. Yeah. We'll try once more, sir. Would you hold on to the light bulb? You want to see that again? I want to see it again. Yeah. Fair enough. So on the count of three, here we're going to give it a try. Everybody ready? One, two, three. Hold it up, hold it up. Thank you very much. Ladies and gentlemen, that's the top of the mind. And the British make sure the Chinese get this ball back. And everybody, welcome to the Jugglers uh, Convention. And as you go through life, let your light shine. Thank you.